Well, paying for college today is out of reach for a lot of families, but millions of dollars are up for grabs. The key is knowing how to get those. Roosevelt Principal Sean Wong and Post High School Counselor Dana Kanashir are joining us to help guide us through this challenging financial aid process. Thank you both for coming in to discuss this topic. This is on a lot of people's minds, so why is it so important for families out there to apply and look for the right funds? Well, the FAFSA um, is the free application for federal student aid, and um, it's something that we encourage, highly encourage our students and families to take advantage of. Um, in Hawaii, every year there's over $10 million left on the table. You're kidding. Um, yeah, for students or families who don't take advantage because they don't complete the FAFSA. So we're at a state right now where um, we're encouraging our parents and families to get the process done. Um, there are a bunch of uh, over $150 billion provided by the federal government for, for loans and grants that they can take advantage of if they complete the process. So um, part of the process is, is, or understanding is that we encourage our parents, no matter how much money they make, to really go through the process and complete it so that they can be eligible for the grants and scholarships that might be available for them. You have first-hand experience. Yes, I, I understand. Do. <laughs> You're not just coming speaking as a concerned principal, but as a dad. So you went through the FAFSA process recently with your daughter. I do. So I have two daughters right now in college. And so my second daughter uh, applied for Kapilani Community College. And I was under the belief that, okay, she's going to a community college and, you know, we don't have to complete the FAFSA. But I was encouraged, continue being encouraged by her counselors, at, her school counselors at that time to complete the FAFSA, but kind of put it off. and. Uh, for her, you know, she was granted the opportunity to um, earn a Native Hawaiian scholarship. No and so in order to receive that, she needed to complete the FAFSA. So I had to kind of rush and get everything completed, but luckily we were able to do it in time to All right. get it done. FAFSA can be your yes. best friend. <laughs> Dana, as a counselor, what kinds of resources do high schools make available to students and parents to help in this process? I think a lot of the college counselors, post-high school counselors in the high schools do a lot of workshops, FAFSA workshops. Um, completion workshops. This weekend we have, uh, many of us belong to a Hawaii Association, College Admission Counseling, mm -hmm. and so we have a workshop on Saturday, FAFSA completion workshop on Saturday at the Hawaii Federal uh, Credit Union, the Hawaii USA Federal Credit Union on College Walk from 11 to 1.30. So parents can bring their taxes, their bank statements, their own laptops, mm -hmm. and we will have financial aid officers there along with college counselors to help them press the button to say submit is what we want. How long a process is it? Because some people can be intimidated, but it certainly would help if you have all that information at hand. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. you can. Oh, well, from <laughs> my experience for this time, my, my go around this time was a lot easier. Um, mm -hmm. I do file my taxes electronically. Mm -hmm. And so there's a process where, you know, some of that information um, will trans easily transfer over. Um, when I first did it a while back uh, for my first daughter, um, you have to get all your, your documents, you know, in place. But it is tedious, but again, it does work out, and every little bit helps. So that's why we're here to encourage our families to get it done as cool. soon as possible. Great. If people can't make the workshop and event, where else can they go to tap into these resources? Um, I know there are some workshops at UH West Oahu is having one on November 25th, mm -hmm. December 11th. I really encourage the seniors to see their college counselors or even the, our grade level counselors are a big help to, to helping our um, students guide the way through the college process. That's a good point. Talk to people who've been through this process, maybe parents who've done it too. And the website I see is collegeiswithinreachhawaii.com. Yes. We'll post that on our website just in case you didn't get it too. But thank you both coming in and just sharing with families out there that there are resources available for college. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Thank you. Coming up, game on for Savvy Shoppers. See what happened when we went to Tilt at Pearl Ridge with cameras rolling. That's next on Living 808. Thank you both for coming in Thank again. Thank you. Oh.